Hello everyone, welcome to Jehu Crochet. Today's video is an unboxing of the monthly yarn club that I had just started receiving last month. This is the Nudie Branks Yarn Club by Felt Fusion. Now, if you haven't watched the first episode of this series, then a link to it will be in the description down below. And this is a brand new yarn club. Last month was the first edition of it, and this is the second one. And this is a monthly yarn club which you can get on the Felt Fusion Etsy store. And since this is an Etsy yarn club, then you can, you know, stop whenever you want or just not get one month, skip a month, um, since you have to get it every month. Uh, it's not a recurring subscription. You have to go on the Etsy shop and order it again each month then um, it is very easy to just uh, stop it or skip a month if you like. The colorway that I'm going to show you guys today is the October colorway and I will show you the inspiration picture in just a second but before, in case you haven't watched the first episode of this yarn club, the Nudibranks yarn club, the colorways are based on a different Nudibrank every month. Nudie branks are sea slugs, microscopic uh, sea slugs who live in the bottom of the ocean. They are beautiful and have magnificent colors and so I think that it was a wonderful idea to use those creatures as the inspirations for each month. And here is a picture of the one that inspired this month's uh, colorway. So this is the picture and as you can see we can expect some very beautiful oranges and purple and blue. I must say that when I saw the picture I thought of, at first that in terms of colors it does resemble a little bit the colors that we got the month before but you know I count on the yarn dyer to uh, know that and do a good enough job so that the two colorways won't be um, too similar so I am very very excited to see what this yarn looks like before I unbox it I want to tell you guys that when you sign up for this yarn club, you can choose every month what kind of yarn base you want to get. There are different types of yarn bases that you can get and the base that I got this month is a different yarn base than the one I got last month because I wanted to be able to see the differences in the yarn bases. Um, but there are several yarn bases that you can get and if I'm not mistaken there are also two different yarn weights that you can get this um, club in and there's even a sparkly option which sadly this month I did not get but I did uh, opt for the sparkly option for next month's yarn so be sure to watch that one as well as it comes. Okay so now it's time to finally look at this yarn and let's unwrap it and see what it looks like. There's the felt fusion sticker on there and let's open it up. <sighs> oh wow, look at those colors. Oh, this is just gorgeous. I love it. Oh, and it's so, so soft. This is a Magnifica. And it's 75% superwash merino and 25% nylon, which is the yarn base that I chose to get this month. It is a fingering weight, 100 grams, 425 meters. And it does say for best results, hand wash finished project in cold water, shape and lay flat to dry. So this is this month's colorway and it has this beautiful blue, dark blue on one side with specks of white and red. Then you have the orange, the yellow and purple with some pink in it. It is just gorgeous. I love it, love it, love it. So vibrant. And I love that you can really pair it with a lot of colors. 
I mean, if you just take a hang of this pink and pair it together, or this yellow, or this orange, or this blue, or this purple, you can really choose each one of those colors and pair it up with it, and it will be wonderful. Beautiful yarn. So, so soft. Look at the colors here. They are so vibrant, so lively. Definitely a good interpretation of the picture and a good capture of this nudibranch in this yarn. I went ahead and I grabbed last month's colorway and I wanted to put them one next to the other because I did um, mention before that the pictures, um, the colors in the pictures were a bit similar and I wanted to um, see if there's going to be a difference in the yarn itself. So this right here, this was last month's color and as you can see there is a lot more of the um, of this purple and pink in it and this is this month's color and here are the blue and this orange um, more present than um, than the other colors but in general they are similar they are not identical but there is um, a lot of similarity you can see here uh, at the orange and yellow part and this um, purple and purple and pink here are very similar but they are not identical and you can definitely see that they were inspired by two different pictures however I wonder if they would be nice paired together do you think that there are enough uh, differences uh, between these two hanks of yarn that you can combine them together in a project without it feeling as if something went wrong in one of the hanks. You know what I mean? Like not that someone thinks that I bought two hanks of the same yarn and they were just um, like different dye lots. Or do you think that they are that there is enough difference between them that if you pair them together in a project it will still look good. I wonder and I'm looking forward to hearing what you guys have to say about that. So let me know in the comments what you think. Let's put this one away so it does not confuse us. This is the October colorway for the Nudibranchs Yarn Club by Felt Fusion. I must say I am very happy with it and I am very happy with my fiber selection. I am going to still try the sparkly one next month and then after I tried all um, three of them I will know which one is my favorite. There are more options on, on the yarn club but those three were my top three and I did want to try one of each before I decide which one I want to get more. So thank you all very very much for watching. Don't forget to go and check out Felt Fusion. Links in the description box below and I will see you all next time. Bye!